in 2022, approximately 500,000 students entered a school building where one or more classrooms lacked permanent teachers. Depending upon what set of statistics you're looking at, there's an estimated 10,000 teacher vacancies with about 20% of teachers planning to leave in the next three, three years, whether that's retirement or just leaving the, the career all, all together. But it's easy to kind of get lost in the numbers and the statistics. And it's easy to kind of not understand what the impact of that shortage is for students in their day-to-day -day lives. Um, many of them have temporary teachers, either external substitutes coming in on a regular rotating basis. Maybe they're internal subs where it's teachers doing coverage from one classroom to the next. Um, but they're at risk of not meeting grade level standards, which such uh, unpredictability and perhaps having people who are under underprepared to teach them at grade level standard. Um, we know that the teacher shortage leads to larger class sizes. We know that the teacher shortage means that children have fewer academic and extracurricular offerings. And we know that it leads to lower quality instruction, um, limiting students' access to individualized attention and support, understanding where their true academic gaps are, and inhibiting their ability to achieve academically.